Here's how the game looked uh, to us and to you as you looked along, and it was, as we go to Scott Trade Center, all Illinois State in the first half. DeAndre Hawkins with the three ball to start things off. Deion Mitchell battling back the other way, strong to the basket, but then Reggie Lynch. And this ended up being a uh, kind of a repetitive theme, Lynch scoring inside there. Mitchell coming back with the putback. It was a 5-4 to four game. You and I never led in the first half. In fact, we've got a startling statistic to tell you coming up here in a moment. First, though, Knight with the layup and Devon uh, Kuhn Purcell with the floater. And you start to get a sense for what's going on. A five-point lead, Seth Tuttle post up. Didn't have much of that in the first half. Was much better in the second. And then a big jump for Illinois State. Justin McLeod with not one, but two triples. Get pushing the lead out to 11 just like that. Knight with the drive to get it out to 21 to 8. Uh, and this is just a great move. A little back door, steps out, boom, hits the shot. Deshaun Knight, an outstanding performance with 53 points in the entire tournament. So he was one of the difference makers. A little uh, Jeremy Morgan steal there for Tuttle on the dunk. That's about the easiest bucket they had all day. Paul Jesperson, who Missed his first couple of offerings, finally started to get it going, and it kept it to within 10 points. But then Hawkins with the three stretches it out here to 28 to 15, leading by 13 at this point. Then watch the long lob dunk off the assist coming up uh, from Hawkins there uh, to take the lead 33 to 15. Uh, Bus uh, hits a couple of uh, three pointer and then follows it with a two. And uh, Nate Buss had an absolutely outstanding uh, game the other night against Loyola, scoring 23 points. He was good again here today with 15 more. Uh, But I'll tell you what, Illinois State was the aggressor. And Ben Jacobson down 36 to 22 at the half. A lot of stunned UNI fans, a lot of rhythm with uh, Illinois State. But then the tale of two halves and the tale of Seth Tuttle, who ended up going for 15 points nine rebounds and three assists gets going early and often as they bolt to a 12 to 1 run to start the second half essentially all of that goodwill by illinois state that had been built up went uh, by the wayside very quickly morgan with a big three-pointer bohannon with the same nice pass there's one of seth tuttle's three assists on the ball game as bohannon knocks it down Lynch finally with the first field goal of the half coming about five and a half minutes in for Illinois State. Mitchell, then Morgan. He had three triples in this ball game today. It was huge defense creating offense. Seth Tuttle, who so often comes out and makes the play defensively and then finishes it off the other way. Uh, and that was the first lead of the game for Northern Iowa and the only lead change in the game. Once Northern Iowa took the lead, they extended the lead and they put their foot on the pedal, just knocking them down. Morgan followed by Wes Washman with the foul and the harm. Uh, He would make the free throw, good ball movement there. And uh, now on a 25 to four run in the first nine minutes of the second half. DeAndre Hawkins in the lane and then a three pointer to get it back to a a 7-0 run to tie the game at 47, but Northern Iowa was able to close it out. Buss with the three ball, that's uh, Bohannon from the corner, and uh, it was uh, all that they needed to do. A Cooper or so with a couple of buckets, one here, a triple, uh, to make things interesting, getting it back to a five-point game, but that would be about it. Northern Iowa takes care of their business, 69 260 Ben Jacobson and his UNI Panthers enjoying uh, their moment of.